Oh, well, hello there once again, friends and fans. Raptor here. Yeah, that's right, the Stranded Mare. You might remember me from my previous video. Yeah. By the way, did you know these bridges don't have railroads under them? Mm mm. I was just looking under there like, WTF, mate. And it was all like, hey, you know, because that's what bridges say. But the bridge does have train tracks on top of it. Oh, interesting. LOL, graphical glitches. So anyway, as we left off, I was in the rap shack right over here. Mm -hmm, that's right, it's this one. By the way, I've got a friend over today, uh, but not really. They're just leaving their car here. I, it's actually been there for three days. I don't know if they're coming back, and uh, those kids next door are really noisy. Ugh. Anyway, this, by the way, looks like the purple station wagon from the... Or no, the Simpsons had an orange station wagon, but Homer drove a pink car. Mm-hmm. Simpson shout out boy that's right so hello once again friends and fans Raptor here the mayor that's right of uh, of Raptacular City and of of course Rock Rapids that's right I've been stranded on a cruise ship you gotta go back and check out part one if you haven't uh, realized what's been going on but what's been going on is industry has been starting to grow so we're able to start making more materials so that way we can expand on our city and I think we'll have some rat packers coming to us soon I keep getting I have a radio here an emergency radio and it's out of batteries at the moment but I'm gonna try to find something to charge them through this video and maybe we'll get a rat packer to join us so that would be great and of course we'll just have to see if we can get them on the radio and they can be a giant help so we've got uh, a little bit of traffic bustling here we still got dirt roads but what we need to do is expand out before we expand up that's right before you get high you have to get get out and get with it you know what i mean keep it funky Raptor is crazy, isn't he? What is he doing? Oh my god, you're embarrassing yourself on the internet, man. Jeez, what are you doing with your life? Ugh. Anyway, the barbecue pavilion is blocking our construction here because apparently it is uh, way too close, even though it's not. Look at that. Ugh. Look at this. Look at that. It couldn't even be further away. It couldn't be further away. Anyway, does that girl have blue hair? Is that Marge Simpson? Just let her hair down. I knew the Simpsons were going to be in this episode. You guys, oh, this is a crossover. It's Simpsons meet Raptor. Oh, this is great. This will be like when the, the uh, Simpsons met the critic. Mm -hmm. That's right, John Lovitz. Anybody remember that? Yeah, you do. Come on. I know some of you remember it. Come on. All right, so apparently we couldn't make these two roads. Are you kidding? Who designed this town? Oh, that's right, me. Anyway. Hmm, that's a pickle of a humdinger of a dilly bar right there <laughs> I'm entertaining myself this is great oh my gosh so anyway if you were here to just learn about the basics of SimCity I guess I'm teaching you it through a very fun and awesome super cool way I'm like Miss Frizzle except with no educational background whatsoever and I do drive a short bus so yeah so we're gonna add up uh, a couple of more spaces for our friends to join probably gonna need some more industry or um, commercial space as well as industry spilled a couple shops up here I heard a few of these people complaining they wanted a Dairy Queen so hopefully that moves in for those of you from other countries who don't know what a Dairy Queen is oh boy you're missing out you see it's an ice cream shop and who doesn't love ice cream I'll tell you who insane people mm-hmm they're ins if you don't like ice cream you cray actually a friend of ours in the Rat Pack doesn't like ice cream or sweets or anything in fact the only uh, dabbling he does in sugar is like a, a mocha grande latte whatever crazy oh really I was trying to save that factory and now it just it derped out on me oh well we have an oblo oblong shape for our industrial sector mm-hmm <sighs> I'm enjoying this game it's really fun I'm enjoying this. I get to do a lot of just talking into space, and you're enjoying it because it's like, look look at this guy on the internet. Brian, come over here. Look at this guy. This guy with his guying and his cityying and the simming. Mm -hmm. All right. So, anyway, what we're going to need soon is probably a fire department, and I think we were able to find some hoses in one of somebody's houses. I think they were trying to steal uh, water out of someone else's pool, so luckily we were able to build the fire station now so there will not be a burn baby burn or any disco infernos alright so let's go ahead and expand again expand expand alright so let's build across the top and there we go so more room for citizens so we got a good commercial sector working in the heart of the city we have got a blank area over here for possible uh, possible fire department possible um, clinic maybe uh, even a, actually a school would probably be, be best over here since they don't really require the straightest means to the uh, high traffic area like the highway here uh, things that you want to keep on the highway are probably the police department and the uh, and the fire department but uh, we'll have to build that first and I think Jill Jill did come in before you guys got here and told me that we did find band-aids so all of our medical needs are met hooray hooray and it's universal health care because I found a big box of them yay international development and stuff yay okay 
So, um, City Hall, right, they say we need some police, uh, but I think we're okay for now. Really, we are. Everyone's being really well behaved. That's because nobody found the liquor cabinet at my house yet. Mm hmm. You just wait until they find it, then we're gonna have some real trouble. Oh boy. Alright, so, uh, again, I don't understand why this road won't connect, but let's. Uh, let's quit babbling here, Raptor, and do some real expansion. So, again, what I want is a fire department, so uh, the best place to put that... If we put it right about, like, up up somewhere near City Hall, we can actually cover our industrial... Well, not our industrial sector, but our commercial residential sector. And our industrial sector actually isn't that far away, if you kind of look at how the road lays out there. It'll also give us okay coverage on the left side, too. Really, what you want, though, is just give your fire station, one, a little bit of room, and two the best area possible to respond to fires. And you know what, this is a cozy little nook here. So let's put it right there, and uh, that's perfect. So we're low on money now, we're making a thousand an hour, and uh, we're just gonna let time drift by, man, just like uh, just like the way sitting on the dock of the bay. Okay, so, I really like the water in this game, it's cool. Is it not moving? Oh, wait, it kinda is. It must be low tide, oh, there it goes. Oh, that's pretty, I like that. Oh, it's very peaceful, very calming. Good graphics on this game, too. Good gracious. All right. So we got a lot of people moving in, people finally finding out about us being dropped off by their parents, of course, and a couple of homes moving in next to the fire department. That's good. Uh, we do probably need some more industrial sectors, but I'm going to try to keep it clean first because uh, look at all these tropical trees, too. I've never seen some of these before. Somebody told me this is a pine tree, so I don't, I don't know what that means. And uh, it kind of looks like fall here, but it's not. It's actually the beginning of summer. But we must be on the other side of the earth. Because where I used to live, or where I did live, or before the cruise... Oh, look, we were able to build a road. Hooray. Where I lived before the cruise, it's now summer. So wherever we are now, it must be going into winter. Do we really want people living across the street from us? Oh, look at this. Yeah, that's right. You know what that is, right? Oh, crap. Ramen's burning on the stove again. Oh. Anyway, well... I'll have to find something else to heat up. That just means I'll have to go to the barbecue pavilion. So, let's get down some more houses, have some friends move in. We could probably have some friends moving down here. In fact, that'll increase our odds of finding somebody to play pool with. That's right, I must have a pool table around here somewhere. I think one of the local bars is opening up one. So, it's all just fuel, though, so far. Maybe we can uh, go uh, to the donut shop and... Uh, and uh, just eat donuts together. I don't know. I don't know what to do in this town. But we're raptacular, baby. So one thing we'll have to do in the future that I'm thinking about, of course, is upgrading these roads. Now, what I'm thinking about is as soon as we find more supply, which means uh, low-density streets, we'll probably be able to do that just before the end of our time here today. Of course, I have a, idea, a, a, a DSL line, so we don't have the best connection here. Ironically, the only thing that I want to be stuck on a desert island with is probably my computer and an ISDN line if I can. But I'll settle for DSL, I guess. So, anyway, let's go ahead and uh, expand. Let's actually build a whole new area. This area is great, but let's let's build something over here. What do you think we should have? Maybe we can. Uh, maybe we can actually. Hold on a second. Oh wait a minute! Look at all the whole beach is clear. There's no more rocks. That means that people in the warehouse were able to make us some makeshift roads. That's right. We'll finally get some asphalt down. That's nice. They were hauling asphalt on that one. Yeah, just like that van. Look at it. Oh, it's passing that. Oh, look at race. Oh, look at that van go. Come on, floor on it. Floor it, floor. Oh, she passed him. All right, nice. That was sweet. Okay, she's going up now. She's blowing through stop signs. Look at her. She's actually leaving town now. That must have been a soccer mom on, their, on her way to a game. I cannot believe she blew past that delivery truck. That was awesome. That was awesome. All right, so let's start with um, a little something-something over here. So we probably... All right, I mean, I'm a cool guy, but... There's some other people who need some real nice homes. There's some people who have kids. There's some people who have uh, who have real families. And uh, I've basically just got Charlie. Burr, burr. So we've got an unemployment crisis, but we can take on some more friends. We'll have some fancier people live down here. And what we'll do is we will provide some more jobs for our our, uh, our, our citizens already. Our s stranded dims. I, I forget. Their survival sims. Survival sims. That's right. Actually, it sounds like a vitamin. Try it. Take your survival sims every day. All right, so let's put down some commercial buildings here. Actually, let's, let's just do it all across the top. That's perfect. And then I think what we want to do is, can we fit in any up here? Nope. Any, ah, you know what? We can build some along this road. And up the house. Nice. I, I love that noise. First of all, I love that. Sometimes I don't like to hold uh, 
control like that because just love that noise of kung 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 ding when you let go of it. Oh, it's so satisfying. So anyway, I do need to play some other games. So we'll hope hope a GameStop moves in before the PS4 is released in this region, and then we can start playing some other games from the what? Torrents resident. Oh, that's right, because uh, Raptor doesn't torrent. No, not at all. Oh, it says torrents. Okay, never mind. Lols. Okay. So, hopefully some more shops moving down here. Yes, and more people are moving in as well. Great. So, uh, let's see. We've got a big, nice flat toe up here. What could we build? Flat toe? Did I just call it a flat toe? A plateau. Jeez. And then, of course, we have our industrial sector over here. That's not even really being built on. But let's build some more uh, jobs for people. They need something to do other than just staying at home all day. They're going to get lazy and fat off of donuts. And they need more clams, of course. So we've got another area building. That's good. We've got okay commercial demand. People are actually wanting to come in and sell things. Mostly the people who used to sell $83 t-shirts on the cruise ship that were made out of 10 cent material. They're actually now wanting to sell good goods to the community. Oh man, perhaps perhaps this is going to be the uh, turning point for everyone where they uh, ran an evil cruise ship to now an evil city. Mm-hmm. So anyway, let's see. What do we do? Oh, we have petition to build an oil well, mm, but I don't think we should do that. That's probably not a good idea. So I think what we'll do is we will probably, hmm, let's see, petition to build an ore mine as well. Let's develop the roads in our city. We're starting to get some nice money coming in here. So let's actually build on, uh, we do have a few more of those rocks left. So let's actually build on to our uh, avenues. I think we should probably have an avenue come up here for some time in the future. That'll be a future marker for future expansion. And uh, in here, we could probably build a nice little, what do you think, a neighborhood or maybe a commercial district? I don't know. There's going to be some real heavy roads. So actually, let's build something for people to come come and shop at. I know we, uh, we have some areas over there and areas over here, but there's going to be a lot of people here, and we need stuff for them to buy and stuff for them to do and places to work. So let's do that. So we'll expand on our our uh, industrial sector a little bit, which, uh, you know what, that means destroying two of these, one of these buildings. And uh, so we'll expand upon that. Perfect. And maybe we can put some businesses over there and maybe going up the side. Uh, yeah. Ding! Oh, I love that. Oh, except the uh, industrial sector is but it's still, it's good nonetheless. So, oh, look at this cool road going up the hill. Oh, wow, there's people actually walking up this road. That's got to be tough, lady. Jeez. Wow, I couldn't do that. These people are real, really fit. Especially, oh, I guess, oh, wait a minute, Kelly Woodrow. All right, let's follow Kelly. Let's see where she's going. Kelly now coming up to the intersection. Will she signal before she takes her turn? Uh, Kelly actually is slowing down now. And is she, oh, she's, wait a minute, her friend, not checking the street before crossing it, but Kelly did. Nice job, Kelly. Ten points for you. Good job. So, uh, anyway, and by the way, did you see that truck that almost hit her friend? Jeez, she's just asking for it. Let's look at the water tower. I like that sound. Ding, ding. Yeah, that's nice. Okay, so getting a little distracted here. Let's turn our city onto turbo. We've got some roads going on. Let's see what happens. By the way, it's a time machine. Someone once told me your arms are actually younger than your body because they were developed la last, I guess. So, I guess I have young fingers and an old torso. I, I <laughs> That, I guess, sounds strange, but... Anyway, it's nighttime here in uh, Raptacular City. I'm sure I'm going to call it Rapteca City at some point. But you know what? I was the mayor of that city for a long time, and that that heart that's still my heart, bro. That's that's I got to represent. I got to represent that big R baby, Rapteca. We went to space. Did you guys read about it in the newspaper? Probably not, because you don't live in my region. Our region was cool. I'm sure your region's cool. By the way, down below in the comments, tell me where are you from, and have you built any cities that are similar to the town you live in? I remember once in SimCity 4, I built a town that was similar to the one that I live by with supporting towns all around it. In this, SimCity is a little harder to do because, one, it is a little smaller, and two, it doesn't, it, it, it's its own game. It, it is v very different from the original uh, well, I shouldn't say original, but the kind of the, the earlier games. So we'll expand on our avenue there, and we'll expand on our avenue here. In fact, let's build around the t City Hall here if we can. Hmm. We might need a little bit more room around City Hall. Mm-hmm. Ah, peaceful rain. Not chocolate rain, and not purple rain, but just peaceful rain. Mm-hmm. So let's get this road nice and straight if we can. Oh, that's going to be wonky, Raptor. All right, hopefully we can build something nice here, maybe a landmark to attract people. In fact, I bet the best way to see friends and fans around us and the rest of the Rat Pack is maybe some type of tower, maybe something that would, you know, you would want to go up and say, wee, wee, on top of, oh, wait a minute, 
Wee wee. Tower. Uh oh. I think I've got an A OK idea. So until next time, friends and fans, this was Raptor saying aloha and goodbye. Oh. Somebody give me another coconut. I finished the pina colada. No, that's right. I live alone. Oh well. Bye, everyone. Ah, uh, well, good morning, Sim survivors. Yeah, welcome back to more of Sim City, as we face some hardships. It's a. Uh, the hell is that moving across the screen? Is that a polar bear coming for us?